The House of Representatives is currently grilling the Minister of Justice and Attorney General of the Federation, Abubakar Melami SEN, over the alleged illegal sale of 48 million barrels of crude oil in China, valued at over $2.4 billion. Malami, in company with the Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Justice, Solicitor General of the Federation, Beatrice uh, Jedi Agba, is appearing before the House at a committee to investigate the alleged loss of over $2.4 billion in revenue from illegal sale of 48 million barrels of crude oil export in 2015, including all crude oil export and sales by Nigeria from 2014 to date. The minister, when he first appeared before the committee on April 27, uh, 2023, had told the lawmakers that the allegation that uh, 48 million barrels of crude oil valued at over $2.4 billion was illegally sold to China is false. The minister had added that there were no particulars of the vessels that transported the fuel to China. Related accounts were a gift of food for the destruction of the president, which is contained in this bundle of documents, which is a uh, The constitution here says, and it does not talk of disbursement, it says the federation shall maintain a special account to be called the federation account, into which, into which shall be paid all revenues collected by the government of the Federation. Are you, in essence, by this interpretation, insinuating that nobody can do whatever reduction is made by a hotel, for example, if you are talking of the transport, from the customer, it must go direct into the Federation account. You, are, you cannot interpret the law to create impossibility. But the essence is, if the money is lodged into the account of the transport, is it eventually, if it is meant for the Federation account, transmitted into the institution responsible for ensuring at the end of the day that it gets into the, into the Federation account? Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.